with respect of the said newspapers, the said Charles Foster Kane hereby relinquishes all control thereof, and of the syndicates pertaining thereto, any and all other newspaper, press, and publishing properties of any kind whatsoever, and agrees to abandon all Which claim thereto. Both, all right. Well, out of cash. All right, Mr. Burns, Charles. I it, Mr. Badger. Just let me sign it, and I'll go home. You're too old to call me Mr. Thatcher, Charles. You're too old to be called anything else. You were always too old. In consideration thereof, Thatcher and Company agrees to pay to Charles Foster Kane, as long as he lives, the sum of... My allowance. He will continue to maintain over your newspapers a large measure of control. Ah. A large measure of control. And we shall seek your advice. This depression is temporary. There's always the chance that you'll die richer than I will. It's a cinch I'll die richer than I was born. We never lost as much as we made. Yes, but your methods. You know, Charles, you never made a single investment. You always use money to, to buy things. To buy things. My mother should have chosen a less reliable banker. Well, I always gagged on that silver spoon. You know, Mr. Bernstein, if I hadn't been very rich, I might have been a really great man. Don't you think you are? I think I did pretty well under the circumstances. What would you have liked to have been? Everything you hate. 